Oh my god. This very um this smoothie bowl <laughs> looks so good. Mm, 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 mm. Outdid myself. Now the consistency of the actual smoothie is always in the question because I can never get it to be because I guess because I don't like my smoothies like thick and very very icy I do like them to be when I make them myself I do like them to be like drinkable <laughs> so yeah child the blow is real but we're gonna sit down because I have some things to tell y'all. I have some crust whitening strips on my teeth because I've had them for a minute. And I only use them when I'm like going out with like special occasions and events. But I think I'm gonna do them like maybe like every month just so I can get myself white. I've been watching um, Mina. I forgot her last name, Mina Abdul or something like that. But she's always talking about whitening and hygiene and teeth. So, yeah. Shout out to you, Mina. Hey, y'all. Welcome to my channel. I'm Krishan. If you are new, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, hi, y'all. This is a new weekly vlog. Um, yeah, and I'm going to be showing y'all some things that I got. Just my week, all that good stuff. Just thank everybody who has come over here to support. It means the world to me. So yeah, let's me get into the things, these dummy things that I have gotten over the weeks. And I want to share with y'all. Oh yeah. Fit check body suit in and some pants Shein. it will be in my haul whatever it comes out but I got some new goodies and this is gonna be so much to eat am I supposed to eat with this <laughs> I don't care I'm hungry we gonna do it It's probably so bad. <laughs> I didn't think this through. My brain, my brain was working way faster than the rest of me. <sighs> so I bought some things and I need to take some things back because Amazon, what is this? This is like a brownish color it's supposed to be like more like this color and then when I open this it has this like greenish discoloration on this so I don't know if it's old because it's so hard to find these and if they discontinued it or not yo that's been discontinuing every single thing under the sun with my shit and I do not like that at all so I'm gonna have to send that back to Amazon or get a refund or get something else so that is what I got I got some makeup finds though oh and I have a package I do have a package it should be my oil my fragrance oil but the big version that I get from P&J Okay, this is what the boxes look like. So she's a big girl. She's a big girl. Now, the one thing I do worry about when I get big things of like, especially fragrance oils or things like that have to be formulated, the consistency of the smells. Ugh. Yeah, she's doing it for me. She's doing it for me. Mm, mm, mm. Still good. Still good. 
Now y'all know I have had the ultra small one and then the medium one and this is the biggest size I got and this is damn near $20 y'all. Look. But it is so good. So me that I have to get it. Because this this scent is right up my alley. If y'all are new to this channel then y'all will probably not know because I am a big good scent smelling cupcake cookie warm sweet fragrance person because I love smelling like a baked good so yeah so that is so me that I had to get it because it's gonna last me a while and I'm gonna put it in my um I'm gonna put it with damn near everything because you can put it with everything you can use it with Soaps, lotions, body butters, candles, bath salts, incense, perfumes, massage and body oils, aroma diffusers, and bathing. And I'm definitely going to put this in my sugar scrubs and in my tub. Because this is going to be with the cocoa butter oil from Palmer that I got. Mm. And, oh my god, I have to show y'all this cocoa butter body scrub. Damn, it's all the way upstairs. I don't feel like getting it. Damn. But maybe I'll put it up here. Like I've been using that. It is so good. I think top three of all body scrubs that I've ever had. It beats the that is my judge. And it's from Palmas. I love Palmas. Palmas is the line. But I got some things from Elf. Um I got some things from Elf. I went to Ulta and got some of this stuff and then I got the rest of the stuff from Amazon and then I got some Fenty Beauty so I got the Fenty Beauty um Fenty Beauty Hella Thick Mascara and I'm guessing this is a pack of two full size volume mascara duo yeah so cause I'm black I don't know that's right Fenty Cause I'm black, baby. So it's a, it's um, that's probably why I got it, cause it was like an on sale thing. It was on sale. So both of them, yeah. So it's the same. Yeah. Yeah, so it's the same. So, I've been using um, Patrick Star's mascara, but I want to get the Patrick Star um, bronzer and then switch over to the Fenty um, mascara. Because I want to keep supporting my girl because ever since I left her for makeup by Mario for foundation, it's just been like, sorry girl. <laughs> so, I'm trying to pick up on other things that I can always re-up with Fenty on. I just not leave out for nothing. I love that. I love that skincare and my skincare regime regimen that I put together. And their makeup is like hella cheap. Like people else should be like a billion dollar business because everything is like so inexpensive but so good. I got the um this instant lift brow pencil. I want to start doing my brows just a little bit. I don't want to go too crazy and I got it in this brown color um what color is this deep brown it was right there in front of me and I got the dark cocoa um deep brown lip liner because I want to start giving different makeup looks especially for content but I don't want to do too much because y'all know I don't like to do too much I still want to look like myself but to uh, update on how I've been feeling, I am in a better place. Um, it's, it's still been a struggle. Um, I mean, health issues don't go away right away. So that's what we're dealing with. Health issues in the family. So. And it was very devastating. So I went to Dollar Tree and I saw this. So 
So I was like, oh, that'll be cute. Can give me a little eyelash curler. To be honest, I don't even know how to use it. With that guard there. Ouch. <laughs> little eyelash curler. I don't know. It'll be something to fun in the videos and it's something to enhance my look. But not too much. Not too much. So I wanted to get Fenty, um, Fenty lip liners. But at the time, not on sale. Too expensive to, for my um, starving artist budget. So <laughs> I got these e.l.f. Um, lip glosses. It's Bubbles. Which has this like this shimmery um, look to it, and this is um, glass lip. I'm about to say glass slipper. That is Fenty, cause I wanted the Fenty glass slipper, but this is just clear. <laughs> this is the clear. You know what I'm saying? And I got these little cute little earbuds, y'all. I've been using these this whole situation, and it has been causing me mayhem. Because of all these goddamn wires. The thing about it is, you don't have to charge them. That's a good thing, but too many wires. So I got these little cute little pink ones that kind of match my phone. And they're not as good as my last ones that I had in black, but they will do. So, yeah. That is about it on the agenda. But yeah, all in all, it's been a good week. Oh, I got some content that I'm working on that I cannot wait to, for y'all to share with y'all because it's a little different. It's a little bit more. It's a little bit more talkative, a little bit more. And I want to have Christian conversations, but I want to do them in different ways. <sighs> One day at a time, right? <laughs> So yeah, I can't wait to try these. I can't wait to try these in videos. This makeup and videos and give you different looks or the other stuff. And I got some food ideas too. So yeah, 2024, we back to business. It's a little late. <laughs> We're gonna try to be consistent. We're gonna try to do what we need to do. Be disciplined structure all that good stuff so yeah so i'm gonna continue my smoothie bowl and all that jazz and get back with y'all take these y'all yeah and i want to invest in a big ignorant bonnet so next vlog when y'all see me hopefully i'll have a big just ignorant ass Monique disapproving in the public in public ignorant ass bonnet so yeah looking like a true auntie chef <laughs> so yeah um I'll catch y'all later in the next um I'll catch y'all later some other time during the week alright what up y'all we are back baby and i am feeling a little better i'm feeling a lot better to be honest i had another day we done another day of creating content getting work done getting our goals met so we can live for tomorrow <laughs> basically live for tomorrow so yeah we have gotten two videos done today um i've just got done doing my how youtube changed my life and with uh 100 subscribers and uh welcome to my channel video a lot of the, most of the people that i've honestly saw with it it is was their like their first or second video on that channel so maybe it do something better for me because You'll have that video and then you'll watch some more stuff. <laughs> so I don't know. But yeah, we got a little makeup done. We haven't done it in a minute. I mean, it's been like a week because I did my other, um, the Valentine's Day, Get Ready With Me, and the hauls, 
which I hope y'all and y'all will be enjoying when they come up, whenever they're coming up, because I decided to change the schedule and plan the the uh, Valentine's Day um, story time of how I got stood up on Valentine's Day has already gone up, but I have pushed back the hauls and um, my vlogs just to start in May fresh have some um, content in the can already and just start March fresh because I really haven't been feeling it. I have been editing but I haven't been feeling like really vlogging that much um, in February because I told y'all 2024 is just not my zhuzh. Um, it has not been going in my favor at all. <laughs> but we're going to get it together and we're gonna push through it because this is something that we want and you gotta still work period even if you work for free working for your goals you gotta work for your money and you gotta work for um somebody was saying something um it was a video on youtube i think and it was saying something along the lines of you have to work for today and you have to work for tomorrow you have to work for the today the things you want today and the things you want for tomorrow i cannot remember how who said it how it went but yeah they said it so yeah and that's the way we are at now i'm wearing this pink this hot pink um high neck tank top that i got from old navy and just some of uh, these old 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 um linen joggers that i got from sheen a long long time ago it was is in my 2021 vlog um haul of sheen so yeah i got a sheen vlog of this year and a fashion over vlog of this year that i i've already done and i can't wait for y'all to see it so yeah we've been working and working multiple videos in the same day i love that for me i love that for us so yeah i'm going to make me a salad because these days be long y'all another long day it is 12 22 i have not eaten dinner at all and i have to still work tomorrow so work at all nine to five and i'm just gonna make me a um a salad with chicken because i like to call them chicken salads but Chicken salads are different than salads with chicken. So yeah, we're going to do that. And I'll come back real quick with y'all. And yeah. Alright, time to eat. The salad is done. I just got some chicken, um, romaine lettuce, chicken, romaine lettuce. Uh, the little chars was um, mushrooms that I overcooked by mistake, but they still gonna be good because I love me some overcooked food. Anyway, um, just bunches for the granola um zesty italian twice baked croutons from Wegmans, some shredded parmesan and romano cheese on it and my asiago caesar dressing that i always normally love but i'm gonna do something a little different right now because i don't know i've been probably i've probably told y'all that several times but i've been wanting a big just wet salad so 
Oh my god. <clears throat> Hold y'all did not see that snot because I felt it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't see it though. But we going before anything happens. <laughs> that would seem uh, too much. Especially when we about to eat. But yeah. So I've been wanting a big wet salad, so what I'm gonna do is put the lid on there because I got these little new um bowl plastic bowls from the dollar store. So what I'm gonna do is just put it in this bowl and shake it up. Oh, okay. Just get it big, wet, nasty, and juicy, you know what I'm saying? But I wanted, I'm going to make it in my bigger, bigger bowl so I can have some for like a couple of days. Oh, look at that. Look how that turned out. Mm, mm, mm. That's just like a big juicy wet. You know, you know how you get like the things at like the stores and you shake it up inside and it's just wet, nasty, and juicy. But good. Mm, 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 It was so good. About to make me iced coffee now. I've been loving making my caramel macchiatos. So good. So good. That was good. Need a little bit more coffee. I don't be knowing because this coffee is so light, y'all. It is it's so good, but it's so light, bold, and smooth. The Stoke Cold Brew that I, was, I told y'all about in my last vlog. Oh, so good. And when it says smooth, it goes down smooth. Without that annoying, strong coffee taste. Now they do have um, other options, but I think they are sweetened, and I didn't want to get the sweet ones. I wanted to keep it unsweetened. The one thing that would made all this better is that if I didn't have all this on, all this makeup and this wig on, and I could just chill on the couch and just ate my food, that would have made it all better. <laughs> I don't have to worry about nothing. When I say nothing, nothing. And already had taking a shower and everything. My obsession with the Parmesan, shredded Parmesan cheese, chef's kiss. And it's never like working all day or burning calories. And then eating something healthy, it still tastes like the best thing ever. But you're not eating real bad. Because when I say y'all, I've been down bad these last few months. Chocolate has been my obsession. Chocolate in there is in the form of candy bars. Not really baked goods, surprisingly. Um, but just like Snickers and Twix and Mr. Good Bars. And oh, I got to show y'all my combo one day. Mr. Good Bars and the Hershey's White Cookies and Cream Chocolate Bars mixed together. 
Mm, it's like a sandwich. Fire. Oh, it is so good. The combo is so good. Or the cookies and cream Hershey's uh, cookies and cream bars with Reese's. Oh, so good. Because you gotta have that. Uh, I have to have that balance because the white chocolate is so sweet. And get that balance of chocolate. Ugh. And I want to tell y'all my regimen been working, my fitness regimen, and my eat healthy work has been definitely working because my stomach has definitely shrunk. And sometimes I think that is like an illusion for me to like to keep eating even when I'm not hungry because I'm not full or bloated like I used to be because everything is, is smaller but this face never lies. This face be looking puffy as I don't know what. But I'm going to watch some YouTube first. Eat my food. Then take all this off. Get all cozy. And then do some editing. Because that's another that we're running out of problems. We, will, we, can recreate, we can create the content. We will film to our heart's consent. But hopefully... The editing catches up like right away. Film right away, or at least day before. But my goal, a personal goal of mine, is in 2024 is to edit an hour a day. And if I do that, I want to see my progress. I should be good with that. And on, on a weekly schedule, weekly track. You gotta be consistent for this algorithm. We fighting against the algorithm, y'all. What's for us is for us, but we gotta work for the for us part. Cause everybody can't blow up overnight. So I'll see y'all in the next next day. Um, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next day. Thank y'all. See y'all later. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I am Krishan. I don't know if this is a intro, outro, but I am Krishan. If you are new, welcome. And if you are a returning subscriber, hi, y'all. So today, because I have been having the most craziest couple of weeks that y'all have obviously seen um i am gonna get myself a self-care day yes i am i got all my good fixings and stuff we're gonna be doing a eating watching what we love to eat all i mean watching our favorite tv shows all that good stuff oh uh, let me do a little fit check my little teddy bear with the little ears y'all ain't this cute from Fashion Nova and sweatpants, black sweatpants from Shein. That is about it. I don't know if y'all seen these um, items. I haven't posted my haul yet, so stay tuned to that. Y'all might see them before this video or after this video. I'm so puffy, y'all. But after this, I've been telling y'all I've been eating so bad. And I need to get back to my regular scheduled program. But I decided to give my little self a self-care day because I've been going through so much these last few weeks. And my self-care day doesn't consist of like the whole spa day and maintenance day. My self-care solely is like eating what I love because I'm a foodie and if you watch my channel if you've been watching my channel y'all know I am a foodie I love food I love to eat so I am going to eat on my self care day and because um I don't eat crazy too much um I'll just eat whatever I want this time though I'm not going to get anything from McDonald's I'm actually going to make my burgers and I got some Wegmans fries which are the mmm Wagman fries be hitting. They are definitely the shit. Um, so I'm going to make myself some burger and fries to mimic McDonald's, but not too much 
if I wasn't eating crazy chocolate candy balls and stuff like that, I would have gotten McDonald's. But we got to cut corners somewhere. <laughs> so I have got me banana everything. We eating banana everything. I got me banana cookies, the um, Magnolia Bakery cookies that I showed y'all before. The banana pudding kind. We got lemon, um, banana cream pie, which um, I just recently um, tried for the first time in my life, which is crazy. So good. I can't wait to have another one today. Um... We had banana pudding, and I got me some, uh, I didn't make the banana pudding, I wasn't trying to do the most. So I bought me some banana pudding from Wegmans, and then I got me some Biscoff cookies to put in the banana pudding, because that's what I put in my banana pudding. So yeah, we, we doing it, and I got some bananas. <laughs> and so, and I'm going to make a frappuccino, because I haven't had a frappuccino in a long time, because I've been going to Panera, and Panera don't be having frozen drinks like that, and when they say they have frozen drinks, it's nothing but iced coffees or iced lattes. So, we're going to make us a frappuccino, and my favorite one um, is like a coffee base with banana chocolate chips. Uh, and caramel and i've been y'all know i've been addicted to caramel lately because if you notice all of my iced coffees got um caramel in it so we are going to do all of those good things mm -mm -mm. so come with me y'all so we could just like banana everything on this self-care day so i don't know what i'm gonna watch though um I might watch Noah's Ark because I do watch Noah's Ark around this time. The wintry months, I love to, mainly I love to snuggle up and watch Noah's Ark with some hot chocolate. But since, I don't know, I might watch something else, something different. But I think I, I do want to watch one episode of Noah's Ark and then we can watch something else and just eat all our goodies we gonna eat desserts for brunch <laughs> we eat desserts for brunch and then i'm gonna make my um my burgers and fries later on so yeah so yep that's what we're doing today comfy cozy even though this weather is giving me a little bit springish but it's whatever we still look cute though um, yeah, so let's get this self care day going. All right, y'all. So I got the Marie calendars, um, banana cream pie, and as you can see, she's been eating. <laughs> and this is what it looks like. It, this pie box is a mess. That's what it looks like when you take it out. And I just couldn't help myself. I just couldn't help myself. But it, it looked way better when I first took it out. And I had to throw out. So as you can see. <laughs> it's been eaten. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. You feel what I'm talking about, babe? Yes, I got a whole pie in you. <laughs> then I got me some banana pudding from Wegmans. It was eight dollars, and she looks so good. Look at that. So I'm gonna put my Biscoff cookies in there, and I've also been eating on. So you can, it's safe to say, I kind of started my self-care day early. <laughs> and I'm going to make me an iced coffee right now. Then I'm going to do a frat later on for dinner. So, yeah. Yeah, I woke up. I got some good sleep today. I was going to wake up early, but I did end up waking up early. But I had to make some phone calls. Then it made me tired. So I went back to sleep. So now it's almost 3 o'clock. We got to put ourselves first. We got to put ourselves first. Lucius, I got put me first. I got put me first. So we're gonna woo side today. Not think about too much. Not think about hardly nothing to be honest. I'm I'm not even gonna edit today. Or if I feel like it, I might do that, but not in a panic mode. So we're gonna watch our good stuff, eat our good food, and just chill out and try to unwind. Just even mentally, like it, this, that's not bothering me today. I don't care about that. You can keep that. Like, that. That's what we're going to do. 
So, yeah. Alright, so the plate is done, y'all. And it looks so good. Got my banana pudding from Wagman's. The banana cream pie. And the banana pudding chocolate chip cookies from Magnolia Bakeries. From the grocery store edition. <laughs> and my iced coffee. My caramel macchiato. Homemade. <laughs> So yes, I put bananas in the banana pudding because I know nine times out of ten people, most people make that banana pudding. And this is my first time trying it, y'all. I should have tried it without, maybe if I try it without um, the biscuit cookies first. And it's good. It's good. What I thought. It's like cream cheese. Cream cheese whipped cream. And a vanilla base. With like a. Maybe a hint of vanilla. Probably they use vanilla abstract. Because it ain't banana pudding. It ain't banana. Yes. Banana pudding. Pudding banana flavor pudding <laughs> so yeah hmm I'm glad I did this because I mean it's still good not not as good as mine of course let me get that best stuff cookie right there and that banana mmm Makes it a hundred times better. Makes it a hundred times better. But the banana cream pie is nothing but, I feel like banana pudding with pie crust. But really, really light. Mm. No, this is hitting. This is better than the banana pudding. This banana cream pie. This one, this Marie Callender one, because I haven't tried anything else, is definitely going to be a staple in my holiday regime now. Because this will be hitting. And I got the chocolate chip cookie version this time. I just want a chocolate chip. I'm going to try them all together. Like, like Beyonce, Tina. All together, ladies. Right. Give me a little bit of everything. All together, ladies. Mm -hmm. 
Boom, boom, boom. Yo, I literally was like, oh my God, I cannot watch Noah's Ark because I don't have Paramount Plus anymore because I got rid of streaming services. But then I remember I had re-upped to do the free subscription for the Super Bowl so I could watch the Super Bowl. So I thought I had lost, lost it. I think it's on Paramount Plus. Oh yeah, there you go. All right, I'm gonna watch the third episode. This one, Wade and Noah, already together. Alright, what up, y'all? It's been several hours later, and I am done relaxing for the most part. So I'm about to cook the burgers and fries. All right, so make my hamburgers. Um, so when I make my hamburgers, I use garlic and herb. Garlic powder, onion and herb, obey seasoning, cause I'm Baltimore, and um, that is about it. <laughs> well, and I'm gonna put some parsley flakes in there because it makes it look pretty. Why not? So let me get a bowl and for my um frappuccino i'm gonna do of course ice coffee biscoff cookie butter um caramel sauce bananas and chocolate chips so i don't know if i'm gonna put the cream in there or not probably not and then with cream on top with caramel sauce on top all that good stuff
y'all will not believe. <clears throat> so good. It is 11.40. Just turn 11.40. Y'all will not believe what I was doing. First, I got enthralled in this cult scandal that is happening in the internet. If you know, you know. <laughs> on YouTube. Then I got to um, the dissertations of Risa Tisa, who did the um, Who the, Did I Marry series on TikTok. And she like blew up. I watched her Good Morning America um, interview and I watched her Tamara Hall interview. Child, when I tell you, and I be going down a rabbit hole. I was just engulfed in all that and then I forgot I was doing my hamburgers then I forgot that I needed to make the fries too and I was gonna put the fries in the same thing because um, the toaster oven is big enough but I didn't so it took an hour for the burgers to get made 45 minutes to an hour and then I had to put the fries in and then make my smoothie I'm gonna soak it you know, in peace. No, I'm eating damn near midnight because I was glued to YouTube. Watching all that shit on YouTube. I don't know why, but I did a sweetie. Um, back in, back in, I was to say, 2021, I did a sweetie, um, the try her meal thing when she did at McDonald's. Now, ever since then, I'll be putting french fries on my burgers. And then because I was enthralled in all that crazy shit, I forgot to like mash the burgers in. So now they're sitting all tall and round and shit. <laughs> and I'm glad this time I was cleaning up as I go. Cause I do not think that I am going to be up for Clean it up our entire mess. I would have been furious with myself. And Wagman's shoestring fries. If y'all got Wagman's, whatever you are, try the shoestring fries. I swear it is the most comparable thing to McDonald's. If you love McDonald's fries, you will love Wagman's fries. Just try it. And they are cheaper than most fries as well. trying to show the real but I just can't have everything crazy in the video Jeez, I really need to clean this place up I don't know if I um, ever told you I want to say I said this in a vlog about the Goya strawberry banana um, like smoothie kind of drink it comes in like one of those like not like a plastic container but like one of those paper folded on top kind of like a milk the new milk cartons not like like um like plant-based milk cartons like you fold i think it's like maybe like cardboard box paper something like that anyway hold on I want to say I showed this in a vlog before. I'm not sure. I want to say I talked about this. But anyway, it is so good. It reminds me of New York City. I used to get this um, brand called Sips. I remember talking about this. But it was a brand called Sips. They have like iced tea. They have like guava. And they had, they, theirs was called um, Fresai Banana, which is strawberry. And in Spanish, then banana. Um, but 
it it was like a smoothie but not more like a nectar it was a nectar so i'm thinking this is kind of like i think this is like a nectar too and a nectar is like i don't know if y'all had a nectars before but it's kind of like the middle of juice and smoothies it's like nature's natural like already ready i don't even know how to describe it because if it is it ready made nectars aren't really like I don't know how to describe a nectar, but all I know is how it is now. The nectars are like in between juices and smoothies for me. So I'm just trying to recover from last night because y'all, I had. I would. Do you know how you get that tingly feeling or that feeling like you just ate too damn much? That's how I felt last night. So today on the agenda is to just basically clean up a bit, um, edit content. That's it. Um, we're not going cute. We're not doing nothing because it is great, guys. It might not look like it in the camera, but it's really, really great. Like, and misty. Looking like Sleepy Hollow outside. I want to thank Miss Jones again for just shout me out in her video that was you a real one for that as my girl um and for not only that the ladies who have come to me on my channel or i have found out or through her which is life with t life with t um i think like she was recommended in another video that she had and I watched her and y'all know I'm a foodie. So I just loved her food and she had these like holiday like cups that she had. Um, hot chocolates, holiday hot chocolates. And she made them look so good, so decadent like a Christmas wonderland. She had the marshmallows and the caramel on top of it. And come to think about it, I think she might have put me on to like all this caramel in my life now. Because she made it look so cute. It was it was just so simple. It was so simple but yet so festive. So hey Life with T. Um and she's so inspirational in her videos and motivational. Um I just I just, I just love when we're like this the small journey of ours and we still trying to be inspirational still trying to be like that little engine that could instead of like being big youtubers thinking back on their life and being inspirational in that way it is so refreshing to see people still on the journey still actually doing things um and being inspirational and wanting to be lights in this content creating world and today, um, I got a notification and Eaton Bougie um, replied and said she came here way of Miss Jones. And hi, Eaton Bougie, if you're watching this, I have watched a couple of your videos today. Um, I've been binge watching because I'm not going to always be able to support when in real time because my schedule just does not... And maybe none of our, our schedules probably ye like right away because we're trying to live life and trying to content create. And how I look at it is this is our small business. This is our upcoming entrepreneur small business. So we don't really have time for that all the time. So when I watch YouTube videos, I start to binge um, the content creators that I have not seen in a while. And... I'm off today though, so I was able to do yours right away. So I watched the third one, uh, that sweater that you had was so cute. That white creamish sweater with the um with the yellow stripes, that was so cute. The the parachute um video, I want to do videos like that. I thought that was hella cute. Them parachute pants you got from Target. If I was to see you, especially when you wore the um the oversized shirt, the oversized white shirt, I would have been like she she's lying she did not get them from target she probably spent, spent like 68 70 something dollars at zara or one of them high price um stores or whatever and put that shit on like i would have been i wouldn't be like no you look you look luxe in that and i like the one um with the forest and the greenish in it 
um, with the asymmetrical top. I love a bodysuit cinch top with a with a uh, uh, just a baggy pant area in it. And I'm in my green phase too, so I enjoy the color scheme. Me and that video that you had with that guy that you just met. That was hilarious. One of the comments was like, um, they were cheesing watching the whole entire thing. And that was me the whole entire time. That was a whole key that you um, did with that guy. And I have a similar story, but it didn't end up, we didn't meet up together. But he was from Atlanta and um, we met in a CVS. But he was trying to get me to go to his hotel. It was 2021. No. Um, not in no pandemic. I'm not meeting you in your damn hotel. But yeah, I have my life to those. So if you see, I haven't had, um, had got a chance to comment on your videos yet, but because I watched it on my TV. So if you get those, you so you're going to get those comments later on today. But yeah, but thank y'all for coming. If anybody else came, and like I always say, comment, subscribe. I love one hell y'all. But if anybody came from Miss Jones, give her a shout out. But like I've been. Way here, Miss Jones. Give Miss Jones her credit, y'all. Cause my girl is my girl is so just a kind spirit, so beautiful inside and out. And and she be recommending. She is a true influencer because she be recommending the good stuff. So yeah. Um Yeah, so thank y'all for coming to my channel and subscribing. y'all both got new subscribers. I'm subscribing to any and everybody else that she recommends so yeah um, anyway y'all I'm closing out the vlog now and all I'm doing is eating leftovers that I had from last night my leftovers my burger and fries because y'all know I was going through it um, with the overeating last night I could not eat all of it but um yes i just watched um but i want to give a shout out to fashion doll for um, the support all the love all the things um via miss jones um today has been so heartwarming so amazing that um y'all have subscribed anybody who has not uh, made themselves known Thank you for the support. Um, thank you for coming. If y'all have subscribed to Miss Jones, just give her a shout out in the comment section of any video you want um, because she deserves all the credit. Um, yeah, uh, Fashion Doll, I absolutely adore you. Plan to watch more content. I love you. Get ready with me. You look so cute. I love red, white, and black together. It is always so cute. Um, vlogging in public will never at least to me, will never be 100% okay. Because <laughs> um, I don't want the spotlight. Um, yeah, your tacos in the video, your tacos, tacos, fire. Um, and the margarita, fire. Um, I'm definitely going to um, check out your Amazon um, storefront because I need that tripod in my life. So bad. But y'all, I just I, I just want to continue on do, doing my thing today um, for tomorrow. I'm eating a little early. Well, it ain't early now. It's like 8 o'clock. But I'm going to try to eat, eat so I can get this content together tomorrow. Because I can't do fashion content if I'm bloated. But anyway, <laughs> say all that. But thank y'all for the support. I'm Krishan. If you are new, um, like that um, button. Subscribe to my channel. All that good stuff. If you are returning, hi y'all. Like comment and subscribe anyway um all that good stuff i will see y'all in the next one i am closing out this weekly vlog period